Yeah, it worked. Nice. Alright. Okay, Rob, just hold this for you. What's up, everybody? This is Yo Paul P. And uh, usually I don't show you the shoes until later on in the video, but I'm a nice guy today, so you know, I'm very happy. So I decided you, you know, to show them to you, you know, first thing in the video. Cause I'm also, no homo happy. about both of us being in Paul's bathroom right now. Yes, uh, it's the only place that gets dark enough to actually see the glow in the dark of the shoes. And so, anyways, um, yeah, before I get into the shoe, you gotta hit that button up top, the subscribe button. Do it, you'll love it. I guarantee it. If you have already, I'm sorry that I keep saying it, you know, but, but, you know, there are people that haven't, if you can believe that, you know. But anyways, um, yes, the shoe that I got today is the Rod Laver Vin Limited Edition. Yes, and these are from the Limited Edition Vault in Singapore. I didn't go to Singapore. I got these... Well, actually, they released two places. They released a uh, limited edition vault in Singapore, and they released in uh, London at number six. And that's where we went, London. No, London. No. no, I actually got these off Flight Club, and big shout out to Flight Club because they were only 150 bucks. They had my size, and a 100, one out of 500 pair for 150 bucks. I had to get them. And so, anyways, yeah, so, um, let me just quickly get into the shoe. First of all, it is, a uh, consortium. Got the silver stripe box with the, uh, with the flip top. You can see me in the reflection you know? of the stripes. It's also got a cool shoe divider, you know. The shoe's there, you know, it divides them. You know, that was a pretty nice feature. You know, you got the Adidas and the consortium on the box there. The box is a little bit beat up, as you can see, but... Um, seems to happen to all the consortium boxes that I get, so it's no big deal to me. <laughs> FedEx! Yeah, FedEx sucks, man. I'm sorry. <laughs> I like UPS a lot more. Or the Postal Service. They're good, too. You know? Anyways, let's get into the shoe. So, first off, it's got navy blue, you know, upper. You know, goes all the way around the shoe, you know around the eye stays, uh, toe cap all the way up the tongue, you know, on the on the rear corner, on quarter, I'm sorry, and on the heel tab, you know, you got that navy. And then on the um, tongue all the way down to the toe and on the uh, on the side panels, you have this uh, really nice uh, light blue uh, uh, grid pattern. Almost looks like graph paper, you know, it's a really nice feature. You know, I really like it, and uh, I like how they how the colors contrast, because that was a really big thing for me with the shoe. This is just like a really nice, you know, chill, simple shoe, you know, that you can wear just like pretty much anywhere, you know what I mean? You know, it looks almost formal-ish, you know? You know those people with like, you know, the they wear the, you know, the grids on their, the shirts with the, with the grid patterns on them, like the shoe, you know? Plaid suits. Well, they're not. They're not really plaid. They're like. They're like. Have you ever seen the? Have you ever seen the dress shirts with yeah. the with the, oh, with yeah, the grid yeah, pattern yeah. on them? Yeah. I always thought those were pretty cool. Yeah. But like, you couldn't wear those with these. But like, if you had like solid colors and then these like at the bottom, like, I think it would be acceptable, especially when they turned out the lights, because they glow in the dark, man. I mean, come on. You know? <laughs> and so, um, you got the little uh, blue uh, Adidas Consortium. Uh, eyelet right there, and then so, just no, it's gonna be a little focus. Yeah, but it, it does, says it does Adidas, say it. and then consortium, and got it on both sides, and then you got just the regular navy blue metal eyelets going down, and uh, the contrasting stitching was actually I thought a really nice touch for where they didn't have the grid pattern, you know, stitching up front, you know, on the eye stay, and then uh, on the back for the heel tab, and then going down the heel. I thought it was a really nice touch, and all the stitching, stitching is uniform. You know, it doesn't look like they missed a stitch or anything. It's just, you know, spot on. And so it comes with the navy laces, and on the navy laces, it has uh, blue metal tips, which was also a really nice, uh, really nice touch. On this one, you have the limited edition vault logo. I don't know if you can see that. It says uh, Vault yeah. Limited Edition. And it's got the weird uh, triangle. Or not triangle, but it looks weird. Tron like, logo. It looks almost like a windmill thing. 
And then um, on this one, you have the truffle oil, you know. And so then on the insole of the shoe, you have a nice combination of the two. I don't know, can you see that? Totally. Yeah, right, yeah that's cool. And so then um, this one for the outsole, it's got uh, it's got a white outsole, you know, and then it's got this little uh, recessed uh, blue line, and that actually glows in the dark as well. Nice. Then on the back of this one, you have uh, it says Vault. Right Intron there. letters. Intron letters, yes. And this one has got the uh, Adidas Consortium handshake logo. Intron hands. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah. And then uh, for the outsole, you got this really cool um, blue uh, outsole. Uh, it's like just the standard Ron Laver, you know, outsole. And it's a really nice touch because I always like More the... like Tron Laver. <laughs> yeah, I thought it was a really nice touch because as you can see it actually like sticks out from uh, from the midsole. I don't know if you can see that, but it's just, you know, slightly bit raised, which I always thought, you know, yeah, was like it, it gives it more of an OG, you know, kind of look, you know, and so uh, anyways, um, yeah, let me just try on the shoes real quick because I actually haven't tried them on yet. And, you know, I know that's, you know, sort Cause of... Because it took him like five days to get them oh, yeah. af after they already hit our town yeah, like like they were already in town and like he missed the FedEx guy like what was it twice, twice? Yeah. yeah and there was a holiday and everything and so you know today I just had these the, shoes have been floating around town like just yeah. like forever today I had on the purple and black Stan Smiths had those forever and I got them from, for like 30 bucks on Shop Adidas one time nice you know Pretty cool. I love shopadidas.com, by the way. It's like the best. Um, gold wings hit recently. I also heard the glow in the dark wings came out uh, in stores today. In stores? That's, that's what in stores. In stores, not online. Yeah, because uh, they had them. They had them on the day that I got the teddy bears in store. Um, they had the, the glow in the dark. They had the glow in the dark wings. They had um, the. Uh, what else did they have? The flames, the 2.0 flames, and they had the uh, the uh, uh, teddy bears. And one more, I think, one more. Jeremy's got one. Flames, wings, or yeah, teddy bears. No, I think that's it. But anyways, yeah, um, they had those in stores. Uh, at official Adidas stores, but. With originals by original stuff, uh, they don't have like a unified street date. It's um, whenever the stores get them in is when it gets it in, when they get it in. Like that Kazuki stuff coming out. Yeah, which I'm gonna get the the whatever whatever it is like jam homemade or oh, whatever. Oh yeah, the jam homemade. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna get those, and so I'm gonna. <laughs> <laughs> I've been playing a lot of beat. DS lately. Been playing with a uh, core DS10. Or whatever that app or game or whatever for the DS. It's He's awesome. been making beats on his DS. It's awesome. Anyway, so um, these are what they look like on feet. This is where I have the Adidas jeans cuffed with the blue on there. It's not too far off, you know. You could definitely get away with it. And this one, I just have it just regular. And so, um, as you can see, it's just like a pretty cool, you know, shoe. It you know sticks out, you know, quite it'll, a bit more than I expected. You know. It'll definitely stand out in the dark. Definitely in the dark, and so and so, yeah. Um, I highly recommend getting these shoes. Uh, I think Flight Club still has a couple pairs left in stock, you know. And also, uh, there are a couple people selling uh, pairs on eBay. So if you don't live in Singapore or London and you couldn't get them, you know, uh, now's your chance to get them on either eBay or Flight Club. Um, and so, yeah. Um, don't forget to rate, subscribe, comment. Um, also, check out uh, Mikey Rocks' channel if you go. It actually, if you go to uh, my channel, um, like right under, right under the videos, there will be a section called like sneaker friends, and uh, Mike's in there. You know. I just noticed I was in there like last night, so it's okay. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry about it. But, but yeah, click it now when you see yeah, it. Yeah, click, click it. it. Click and so it. and so, click it. You know, his name's right there. And also, you can go on Twitter, find him, twittercom slash MikeyRocks18. That's Rock spelled R O X one eight. And then uh, you can find uh, me on Twitter, twitter.com slash yopolyp, all one word, all lowercase or all uppercase if you feel like Billy Mays mode, you know what I'm saying? Rest in peace, Billy. <laughs> Anyways, so, um, yeah, and uh, 
that's it for this video, so stay tuned for the next video, and it will actually also be a limited edition pair, one of 500 as well. I'm getting limited edition shoes left and right, man. Left and right. You know, so uh, be sure to check that out. It's going to be awesome, you know, till the next video.